All right, guys, well, I've got a little bit of a wasp issue over here at the house. Um, let's go check that out real quick so you guys can see what I'm up against. Um, yeah, I noticed that guy way over there. Oh, geez, yeah, they're just buzzing around like crazy over there. Can't really see it too good, but there it is. So, yeah, here's Pat, and we have the tactical spud gun. So I got the GoPro on the end there. Watch your eyes, but we got the laser pointer. Did you mean like tapes to do that? Okay, yeah. And the most important part, the potato. I got the potato. And we got the camera set up here. You see what you shoot it, Pat? Did you So the first shot Chris. didn't quite wipe them out. We thought we could take out the whole nest. So here we are setting up for the second shot. Spray, spray, spray a peu près trois secondes. C'est pas trois secondes. Il court vite parce qu'il veut sortir de là. Moi j'ai déjà même passé le bio. Oh! All right, guys. Well, it's the next morning, and. I'm gonna go do a uh, preliminary damage assessment. Um, well, I'm gonna see what the aftermath is really. And I've got my trusty can of insecticide here. Yes, we did have an insecticide can the whole time yesterday, uh, but we just had it there in case. And I thought it would have been a little more fun to get rid of the nest, a little bit more dramatically anyways. And honestly, like, I don't endorse animal cruelty or anything like that, but getting hit by a high velocity potato versus dying slowly from a, a neurotoxin insecticide is not really a better way to go. Also the nest was kind of posing a danger to everybody around my yard and to myself uh, when mowing the lawn and such so it kind of had to go. Uh, so I vouchered for the potato cannon. It's right here. It's never let me down so did its job, got rid of the nest. So I'm gonna go grab my other camera with my zoom lens because I'm still scared to go close to this thing. Um, luckily, Pat was brave enough to uh, be right up in there in the, uh, in the danger zone and he, uh, he got rid of the whole thing. And actually, Pat was crazy enough to go in after the nest was taken down and spray them uh, with the insecticide anyway, just to clear up any stragglers. Um, so, I mean, the can is pretty much empty. I didn't get that on video, unfortunately. I'm gonna go grab my other camera and let's go see what the situation looks like. So here is the obliterated nest. Unfortunately, the shed suffered a little bit of damage, but nothing too crazy. I gave it a couple of shots of insecticide too, just to be 100% sure. But all in all, uh, a potato cannon is very effective against a large wasp nest. Thanks for watching.